Hey girl, hey, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am your favorite girl, A. Marie. And as you can tell by the title, you guys, I wanted to do a fun, interesting type of video. We're gonna be doing a makeup look. This makeup look is gonna be my content creating go-to makeup look. But the twist is I will be using my shop mustache products because I don't see videos like this on YouTube so the type of looks you do in a quick it'd be really quick for me <laughs> when I'm not talking and explaining and stuff but it's like a really quick simple look that you use for the rest of your content creating so I'm gonna do a quick face and you will probably see this face in a couple of more videos because your girl got some hauls and stuff like that to do. Hopefully you guys are interested in this type of video. Let me know if you would like for me to make more content videos like this and I will get them done. But before we go any further, I would love for you guys to hit the subscribe button as well as the notification. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and comment something down below right now. You know what? leave a camera emoji for content creating now let's get into it let me go ahead and give the disclaimer right now if you hear a noise a little humming noise going on right now you guys know i'm probably tired of saying it and i know y'all probably tired of hearing it but i film in my garage so it'd be hot we're in august it's hottest in texas so i had to buy me like this little cooling fan <laughs> to go out here and it's a, it's a little mini fan but it's supposed to be quiet but if y'all can hear it that's what it is i don't have my contacts in so we're gonna just go off of a hope and a prayer at this point so i'm gonna start off with the la girl concealer correct the correcting orange concealer i'm just gonna put it on a few little spots like right here on my forehead I'll put a little bit up under my eyes now a lot of my dark marks are my moles and my freckles I did not put my primer on but what I was saying is with this fan on it's gonna dry everything down pretty quickly so it's a good and bad thing but it keeps me from being hot Now, usually we put on our primer before the corrector, but I'm gonna go in with one heck of a block by Soap and Glory. And I'm just gonna put a little bit in my hand, pat it in since I already accidentally put in my corrector already. So I'm just going to, so that I won't make the corrector move. I'm gonna be using the Benefit Brow Styler and this one is in the shade five it's kind of big and it does have the powder it has the pencil on one side the powder on the other i kind of like the skinnier pencils better but she's still cool and i do still do my eyebrows the same way basically next up real quick we're going to use the maybelline age rewind eraser concealer the instant age rewind and this one is in 144 caramel i'm going to use it to clean up the bottom of my brows right now and then we'll use it later on to highlight and conceal all right so this is how we're looking so far trust the process trust the process I am gonna, going to go in with both my e.l.f. Soft Glam Foundation. This one is in Deep Warm. And I'm going to mix it with a little bit of NYX Born to Glow. This one is in Gleam. I am going to mix a little bit. I won't put a lot of highlight, but I just want to put a little bit so I can mix up in there. And if you haven't seen my review on this e.l.f. Soft Glow, I suggest you go and check it out. 
I did a full review on it. If you haven't purchased you a Elf Soft Glow, I encourage you to run out and get you one. Like right now. Now, what was left on my concealer brush, I am going to mix it a little bit with the foundation and clean up the top of my brows. Hey, you guys. Sorry to interrupt the video. I wanted to come to you guys and let you guys know about these new glasses that I got from Fermu. I got some Shout out my barber. Okay, if you guys love trendy, cute, stylish, prescription, non-prescription glasses, sunglasses, blue readers, UV, all those type of eyewear, then you guys need to get you a pair of Fermu glasses. So they did send me over a pair and this is what they came in. This is what the box looked like. They give you your glasses in a sleeve like this of course it has fur move on the sleeve and these are good when you're not wearing them they also work as a duster and they did let me choose the glasses that i wanted to promote and you guys know i am a rainbow girly so look at these glasses <laughs> this looks like a rainbow splash they're plastic black rim now they did come white too with the white trimming but i thought black will go with everything mm -hmm. and the sp the splatter of colors would go with anything that i will wear so let's try them on this is my first time oh yes oh this is cute I like it. They are so cute and stylish. Mm -hmm. I'm going to have the code and the link down below for these particular glasses as well as Fermu's website. That way you guys can go and purchase you some stylish glasses. Thank you so much to Fermu for sending over these glasses. I love them and I can't wait for you guys to get you up here prescription or non-prescription and send me the pictures once again thank you for me for sending over these glasses now back to regular program oh, it's drying on me okay i gotta turn my fan off because the highlighter is drying on me quicker than normal fan is blowing too hard All right, so now it's time to go back in with the instant rewind, and we're not going to put a lot. I will be using this little concealer brush that I used to do my under eye, no, my underneath my brow, my brow bone. Sorry y'all, my mom is out of the country and it's me and my sister's job to pick up the stuff she needs and send it to her. So my sister was making sure that she picked up the right thing. I already packed up her stuff for her. So all my sister has to do is add the stuff she's picking up right now. I did switch over from the brush to my puffer just to blend it in better. Um, but yeah, I do have a couple of fun content coming up for you guys. I'm going to go in with my Ciate London Everyday Vacay Setting Powder. It is coconut setting powder. 
and all that good stuff so hopefully you guys are interested i know i know i know that i came back to youtube and then i went missing for like a month or two but it was because my computer had broke and i didn't have a way to actually edit my phone wasn't holding all my content and stuff like that then i lost a lot of content using the i think it's called a backup drive or a backup disc or something my mom gave me it's like one of those terabyte um hard drives there you go my mom had gave me a hard drive to use to put all my content on so that i could stop having to delete it and i guess because i don't know how to use it that well i accidentally deleted everything so my mom just gifted me a newer mac so a newer mac laptop so we're back in business now while i was gone i was still trying to be active on social media so if you're not following me on instagram facebook you need to go ahead and follow me there because when i'm not here that's where i am now i'm gonna go in with my black radiance pressed powder this one is in bronze glow and as you can tell i really love it because i done hit pan on it i am trying to finish it up but this stuff lasts so long going in with my Juvia's Place bronze bronzer in dark. I basically just mix the two shades. I do one of these numbers. Tap off and then go in. And as you guys know, I like to pat everything in before actually blending. That's just my thing. All right, I am gonna take a little bit of my Julius Zulu palette. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of this brown, very little. And I'm going to get in my crease. Now, you can use any blush that you want. I am going to go in with Elegancy, Elegantly Me Cosmetics Blush in Touch of Spice. This is a small, small business, and I was a part of their team um, years ago, and this was one of my blushes that I created with them. It was like a three-piece set that... I created with them I don't know if I'm still with them or not but they're very affordable and they are a really good brand so if you guys would like to support them or look into their business I will have them linked down below just so pretty and natural every day and a lot when I say every day that's my every day it may not be your every day type of look you know what I'm saying so I'm gonna go in with the Marc Jacobs I don't know what the name of this mascara is but it's one of my favorite mascaras now I am debating on if I want to use lashes or not but I think I am going to go ahead and do it sometimes I do sometimes I don't because look at that Look at how this mascara has my lashes just extended. Like, my lashes are never this extended. All products that I'm gonna, that I'm using in today's video will be listed down below. I do take time out to fill out the description, what I call the hot box. So, it's on fire for a reason. You know, the box is hot for a reason because it be having all information 
listed below. All kind of links, my Amazon storefront, products that I use in videos, you know, all that good stuff. These are some lashes, sample lashes that I got. And when I was, when I was doing my business, I still have my business. I just don't have an online website for it, but I do still have my business. So these are one of the samples that I had looking into to see if I wanted to sell these. And I never did go back and pick them up. So I'm gonna use it today. All right, while those dry, I am going to set my spray with the Milani Rose Water Prep and Hydrate, Prep and Refresh. And I'm gonna put on a little bit of the Revolution Gingerbread Heart. And, oh, it's called Gingerbread Heart from Our Heart Revolution. I'm just gonna do one of them numbers and tap it on a little bit. Ugh, too much. I'm gonna go in with my Jordana lip liner and Coco Loco. And when it comes down to doing content creating, you could go with whatever lip you want. Now, when I tell you guys all them years that I was not wearing glasses or contacts, y'all, I really don't know how I was getting around through life because even this distance right here, I really <laughs> cannot see it. I really cannot. All right, so basically we're done. I am gonna go in with the Even Snuggy lip crayon and this one is in carnation pink i know some of us still are not supporting even right now i done said it a couple of times in a lot of my videos i was on their pr list i think my coupon code still works for those who do still want to support even um but i have a lot of products by them okay so this is my first time using this. It's in Pink Carnation. I really don't know how they work. I really need a tissue because every time I do my makeup, my nose wants to run. I am going to top this off with... I'm going to dab just a tad bit of my concealer. in the middle to ombre that this is the finished look I'm going to spray one more time here is my content go to content creating makeup look this is the go to look now I'm not going to lie this is basically my everyday makeup look as well but sometimes for my everyday makeup look i go a little bit more snatched in the nose it just depends on how i'm feeling hopefully you guys enjoyed this video go ahead and comment down below and let me know your thoughts everything that i did use is linked down below um but yeah that's it i love you guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will catch y'all in the next one deuces